Hello guys, welcome to Jamie Tech. In today's video, I have brought something cool for you people. We have to count all people in SQF light, right? In Flutter, right? And here we have to calculate total sum, total, you know, sum of records in in a, uh, of a column, right? So we have uh, a quick example right here. We can see this. Um, we have calculated the total students. We have total three students. I mean, gym students. And here we have, uh, you know, collected uh, three, uh, you know, mm, three faces, right? I mean, for example, uh, per had a six hundred, and we have got one at hundred, right? So here we have to go uh, through the quick. Uh, you know this is the code very easy uh, we have a future you know future this and count people we have a function I think we are going to get the database and then we are assigning these things to account right so uh, here ask you fly that first initial value of a DV connection that rock query and here is my cone count everything's here from my gym table for okay and here I'm just uh, you know printing and here this is what I'm returning okay here we have a future because uh, we have to wait for these things and here uh, we have a, a DB client and we're getting the database initializing uh, variable result we are assigning this to a result uh, look at this data DB client that raw query select some you know some of fee price right as total you know from gym table for okay and here i'm going to printing uh and this is i'm um, re uh, returning you don't have to make a mistake in this thing right you don't have to uh you know return a single uh you know uh, result you must have to add a to list otherwise it won't work so i'm going to go to the just here to the trust page where i want to show here first of all i have uh, this uh first one number and here total and then we have a calculate total one more function and here count people in calculate total we have something uh, variable where we get the uh, total you know uh, get total function you know we are calling that database but before this uh, database helper we have initialized the instance of database helper and uh, you know this is a database helper class and here so uh, this is simple uh, print total sum we printed and here set state we are assigning total sum to the total and simply you can print the total uh, here we have uh, students and total you know fee we are printing the fee in the text that's so easy and here uh, in the count people we are going to say that in count you know about db.con exactly just refer to there and here we must have to set state we are assigning this con to number right and we have did it total fee and before total fee we have all students and simply number that's so easy so let's check it out already the result is right down but let me do it uh, maybe just I want to add one more things right uh, we have a people count three and the total uh, this and flora you know we have calculated it and so I'm going to add one more person uh, what should I do the word pay uh, Jeremy my favorite bodybuilder Jeremy and what I don't know what's his father name but father and here maybe this a random number maybe you have just this number serial number and here we are going to say that 600 it's fee but this uh, to 2021 would be just default value right this is a demo just I'm still working on this project right so here uh, we have click on it but we have just something like this so uh, look at this all students are four and you know total fee is increased by 600 oh wow this is so cool thank you so much for watching this video don't forget to share with your people forget about subscribing hey thank you bye bye